freezing. She is not. No. Whose legs is this? Jolie, Juna, or Jessa? Is this Jolie? <laughs> Bom dia, guys. Good afternoon. Good evening. Welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers. My name is Didi Tayutu and my wife's name is Roman. Roman. For the ones that can't pronounce it, just say Romy because <laughs> nobody can pronounce this name Roman or just spell it the other way, Eni Amor. I love that way of uh, calling her this name, Eni Amor. We are being sand. Blown away. <laughs> the sand is hitting my feet. It's minus 20 degrees. It's like really freezing cold over here. Uh, I thought I could still wear shorts and it feels like minus 20, but it is. Oh, <laughs> it's cold. And I, I, yeah, I thought like I can still wear the flip flops, but no. But guys, today's video together with my wife. In today's video, of course, bombing you so with some really cool Bitcoin charts. I'm going to make a short video again because it's weekend. I want to zoom out with my wife and do some fun stuff with the family. Um, yes, also talking a little bit about some news that I read, thanking Crypto Chico for his shout out, of course. It is yesterday's video to the Bitcoin family um, and mainly talking probably about some family stuff or something. I didn't prepare today. So, so enjoy today's video, guys. Bam! Let's start with the first part of the video, the Bitcoin TA part, the chart where I bam you with the really cool charts. This part, bam! First, zooming into the chart. Let's take a look at a four hour chart created by Jack Sparrow. Yes, the only Bitcoin pirate we know in Twitter. Jack now created the chart where he's saying like, oh, we can go up or down. Yes, I've been saying that many times. That's very logical. But his chart is also uh, referring to numbers. Or we will follow this line on the upside. It will mean we will go to 19,500, pull back a little bit, and then break up to 21K in Bitcoin price. Or the other option is, from here, we will break down out of this pattern, and then we will go downwards to the 18,500 US dollar level. And if you break that one to the 17,200 US dollar level, and if you break that one to the 16,000 US dollar level, don't freak out, we are not going bankrupt. Everything is okay. We yeah. can still walk a beach and just give each other a kiss on the beach. So don't worry, be happy. But that is the biggest question. Are we going to go to 21K or 17K? I've been sharing this information already every weekend. The CME close at Friday evening at five. Check that level. There is a huge chance we will, we, we will return to that level on Monday. So yes, I think in the weekend, people can play a little bit with the price but we will probably return to the CME close that we saw on Friday. But like you know guys, I don't like to zoom into these charts. I like to walk on the beaches with my wife. So I zoom out on the charts, you know? So let's zoom out on the chart. Let's take a look at this very beautiful chart. This one, bam! On this chart guys, you can see what happened after the true previous halvings we saw before this one. Every time, we reach the price of the previous all-time high, the Bitcoin price starts to accelerate. That's the official BAM bull run. Like you can see, the first halving line accelerated with 36 times the Bitcoin price at the halving. The second halving accelerated with 17 times after the halving. And now the third time, I think the halving we were around 10K, let's say that we even underperformed the first two halvings. So we went from 36 to 17, and from 17 we will go to eight and a half. Let's, let's do just eight. If the price would go times 10 from the halving, we would still see this 80K Bitcoin price in the next year, end of the next year in December, because every time the bull cycle ends in December, 2013, 2017, and yes, I think 2021 again. So let's see what happens, but I like this chart because it's a zoom out chart. I have one more zoomed out chart because it's weekend, guys. I want you not to freak out. I want you not to stress out. I want you to zoom out and walk on the beach 
together with your partner or your kids do something cool while you just have these zoomed out charts in your head so you're not freaking out on the Bitcoin price going to 20k or 17k because that doesn't really matter because let's take a look at this chart guys BAM on this chart again a chart by Charles BTC yes I love the charts chart BTC is making follow him on Twitter because he has really cool charts but don't follow him and just follow my YouTube channel subscribe to it hit the notification bell so you will see these charts every time again in my video with on the background some beautiful piece of nature in Portugal or wherever on the world on this chart guys a really beautiful visual chart she doesn't know what chart I'm talking about that's why she's quiet at the moment and um, yes I'm prepared but you can see the tops of the bull runs in this chart. You can see the $29 top very long ago. I, w I wish I was already in Bitcoin at that point and just invested $1,000 at $29. Even buying at the top then was still a good investment. Then we see the second top around $1,130 US dollar. And then we see the third top around $19,650 US dollar. That was the top in 2017. So now you see the tops. The tops are on the top of the chart. Now we are going to look to the other things that you can see on a chart. You can see these blue cups, these blue filled cups. These are the important ones on this chart. If you take a look at the $29 top and then you take a look to the right on the chart, you can see this blue cup filling. The moment that the blue cup is full, that is the moment that we break the previous all time high and that is the moment that BAM Bitcoin flies up again. Then the second time around $1100 you see the same, the moment we surpassed the $1100 level. The cup was filled blue and BAM! Bitcoin flew to, and Bitcoin flew to 19,700 US dollar. Now, if you look to today and then you look to the left on the chart, you can see that this cup has been filling since its 19,700 level and that we now are reaching, you know, the top of this cup. So yes, we are now filling this cup and so I think that we will see the same that we saw in the previous bull run after that this cup is beautiful filled blue so when we make a double top you know when we break the previous all-time high then we will accelerate all the way into this bull run so yes we can see a huge increase again between now and the end of 2021 zoom down charts don't freak out zoom out enjoy your weekend that were all the charts for today i'm not going to bomb you with any dd bam bam charts if you want to know more about the bam bam indicator that i'm talking about a lot this uh, week just go to the Discord server. You can see all the profit charts of this week, all the profits we made nicely explained on the charts. She doesn't know how many profits we made, but I will tell her after this walk um, because she doesn't care about money. She only cares about Bitcoins. I have a Bitcoins here, I've had my Bitcoins there. I'm hodling my Bitcoins everywhere. That is a preview of a song that somebody is making for us. I wrote a text about our life and that is being converted into a song. Soon you will hear more, <clears throat> and not of this ugly voice, but of a beautiful voice of a beautiful singer from Mexico. Aha, Alejandro. No, she was not called Alejandro. She's called Lore from Mexico. If you want to join the BAM Indicator, go to ddbam.com or join the Discord server that is full with educational stuff, full with family members, over 800 family members. I think soon we will break the thousand level of family members that are all there to help each other because I incentivize people there with family tokens if they help each other. Do you help someone else in the channel? You get one family. It's nothing. It's only 13 cents. But if you do it all day long, all day long, you will make some money in families that you can then exchange to Ethereum, Bitcoin, US dollar theater, or just huddle family and you share in the reward pot of December because in December again, a 40,000 family reward pot that is $5,200 we are giving away to people that huddle family tokens in their wallet for the whole month of December thumbs up for family. I am freezing. Shall we walk that part away and check if the restaurant is open? It's good, yeah. It's uh, cool. Uh, that was all the information today about Bitcoin, about charts. So now let's jump into the um, blockchain news part. This part. Bam! Very short part. I only want to thank Crypto Chico for mentioning us in his video yesterday. 
think Crypto Chico is a really cool YouTuber, long haired dude like me. Only he has 150k followers on YouTube and he mentioned us yesterday in his YouTube channel, that crazy family that went all in and was featured on CNBC. Thanks Crypto Chico for if you're watching this crazy cool Bitcoin family YouTube channel as well. That's how we long haired dudes support each other in this crazy world of crypto. Chico. That was the Bitcoin news part. Now let's jump into the family part, the part where she finally gets to do and say what she wants to say. BAM! Do I need to do the introduction? Oh, okay, or? <laughs> I didn't know. Yeah, okay. Oh. You just asked me this morning, are you going to walk with me? I don't know what to talk about. Oh. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. We built up the Christmas tree. Yeah. Yeah. That was an adventure. <laughs> Buying Christmas stuff with Jessa and Juna. Yeah. And the real Christmas tree is hard to find here in Portugal or expensive. Yeah, they didn't. No, we, we we searched for it like everywhere, and then we found one small garden center, and they asked like 66 euros or almost 70 euros, eh? 66 euros for Christmas tree. Like yeah, like this Christmas tree, like six six balls and the and the tree is full. Yes. So we didn't buy that one. No, we bought a fake one. A, fi a fake one a from fake the one. Chinese store. Yeah. <laughs> So that's a fake fake one <laughs> because they got they make copies of copies so that's a fake fake one yeah so but it's we did a, that. and it was completely like like not the type of tree we normally have like a full blossom tree this was like like a bolt tree how do you say this in english <laughs> i don't know we made the best out yeah of it. pushed a lot of balls and serpentines and all that stuff serpentines and then now it's a beautiful christmas tree so the house is pimped to a christmas house a little bit but we are not going to expect Christmas uh, visitors because our family is not allowed to fly or they think they are not allowed to fly or they need to work yeah, So you were saying something about a dog. dog Oh yeah, dog oh, we, we, Let's talk about dogs Why? Did you see the episode of Gokstein Media guys yesterday? So in Gokstein ah. Media Yeah, Jessa, we were talking about the dog because Jessa wants to have a dog for breakfast No, no, no At breakfast Jessa said she wants to have a dog and now she's saying like, ah, I am not going to make a list for Christmas because I only want a dog. And she sings a song, all I want for Christmas is a dog. dog every day. <laughs> every day. And, and, you, and we are like really thinking about this because like a dog, while you travel the world, I can imagine it when you know, when you just drive around the world with this car. Yes, I can imagine a dog. When we need to fly to Asia or when we need to fly to South America, I just don't see it happening with a dog. You? Maybe a tiny dog. <laughs> yeah. I think you see where this is going, guys. I don't think I have any choice. I think it will be a very tiny, tiny dog that we need to get for Christmas. Let's see if we can buy it like, like tiny. <laughs> How do they exist? What is a tiny dog? I don't know. Yeah, like under the, under the five kilo. <laughs> under five kilo. Yeah, she had Declan and Kira. She loved them. Uh, yeah, in Thailand, she took care of them, and it, uh, she were, loved uh, them, but she didn't walk them every day. It was also stressful. It wasn't easy to walk Declan. He attacks every dog, and he's like. But you know, know what you big? get if we buy a new dog. Yeah, but you raise him for yourself. I don't know. You see where it's going. <laughs> Whatever <laughs> negative part, I will say. Yeah. Yeah, always look on the bright side of life. A dog is not the bright side of life. It's a shit time. Always make the best He shits out of in your everything. house. He shits on the floor. You need to walk him every day. No. He kills other dogs. Yeah. All that stuff. I, I'm more the, like the. I prefer more. It smells like food, so maybe they are open. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah we can sit inside. There is a uh, good weather. Um, okay. I don't think we have any other news. It's a little bit boring today. Well, Maybe. we can drink a cup of coffee and think about it. And if we walk further, then we can. Yeah, talk. I was thinking the same. Let's yeah. do a coffee and a fish <laughs> soup, and then we are full with some fuel, and then we talk yeah, on the way back. I haven't ate anything or no. drink. Now you can see it. You're really losing weight. No. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Smells see good. you in a bit <laughs> after this dinner here at this beautiful restaurant. Wow. This one, damn. It's 
empty, so we have all the space. So we just had a beautiful lunch at the restaurant. I was bloody hot because there was no wind and now I'm cold again. I was like, I'm going to lose my sweater, but now it's getting cold again. And the wind, if you sit in the sun without wind, it's hot. Yeah. But else it's uh, yeah. too The strange thing is now in these restaurants, when we sit there, they always are like, ah, are you the Bitcoin family, the guy? So that's pretty cool. If you stay longer at one location, then they get to know you a little bit and you get really cool conversations about uh, Bitcoin and everything. Huh? Everything is going pretty good, except that we just got a small notice that Roman's father was taken to the hospital because of his uh, breathing problems. Oh, yeah. Lung disease. Lung disease, so... Yeah, so we need to wait out, wait out and see what will happen. Yeah. So because, that's uh, why you never can predict how your future will be. No, we can never plan, you know, and that's... Uh, <laughs> Because if something helps, happens to, to him, we, uh, or no, whatever, we, we will fly to the Netherlands, or we drive to the Netherlands, whatever is possible, because, you know... Paolo is also open. <laughs> Paolo is open now. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. yeah, we'll wait and see. I don't know what's happening. No, we, we will... Uh, to, um, do all these tests. We will hear today what is... Uh, yeah. And further, yeah, like the guy in the restaurant, he comes up and he's interested in Bitcoin because he bought Bitcoin, I believe, in 2000. Yeah, yeah, he bought it at the top. he also liked our story because he's like, yeah, I now changed my life because of all that's happening in uh, Lisbon and with the work and I changed, I now work here on the beach. He says, yeah. and I love it. More and more and more people are going to change yeah, lives. that's probably a good thing about um, COVID. the flu. <laughs> that people are now maybe... Waking up. Yeah, but need to make a decision because the company isn't doing that well or whatever and then they realize what am I doing the last 25 years of my life is getting bored and maybe I need to do a different thing and now you get a little bit pushed into your decision yeah so you they, are, they are like forced almost forced to take the decision yeah. to change life and then they see it's a good thing to change sometimes yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. sometimes it is so you we just came from that bar and that <laughs> restaurant are we going to drink a cocktail at Paolo as well or are we going home what do you want what you want? Mm. Yeah, we can drink one more. One? But then I need to go to the toilet and then Paolo doesn't have a toilet. No, but Paolo has the best anti-COVID drink that we drink every day. I will now show you what my anti-COVID drink <laughs> is at Paolo. And Paolo is a really cool guy here with a very cool beach bar, Extreme it's called. So let's, uh, let's go there and show these followers what anti-COVID drink is. There are two versions. You have the anti-COVID virgin and you have the anti-COVID Didi style. So virgin, she's still a virgin, like a virgin. Ooh, people won't believe that. I'm the virgin uh, Mar Maria. Virgin Maria. <laughs> <laughs> yes, three kids were just thrown at us out of the sky. Looking at you. <laughs> this bar, guys, this bar is my special anti-COVID bar. <laughs> Bam! Extreme anti-COVID. But you get very, and very grumpy. You get very grumpy <laughs> and you get very beautiful. This is my BFF in Portugal, Paulo. He's Hello. making my virgin anti-COVID and a Didi style anti-COVID. I'm going to show the people the difference. Okay. <laughs> She's still the virgin. Yeah. That's a special ingredient. The Didi I feel fresh, I feel protected. I just had my anti-COVID drink at the Extreme Bar Lagos. Go to this Extreme Bar. The owner is called Paolo. He is one of the nicest BFFs I have here in Lagos. This Dutch guy just told me. BFF means Bitcoin friend forever. So Paolo is also a Bitcoin friend forever. Uh, it was a really nice chat again. Drink. Uh, no wind. No wind. Here is windy again. 
we are walking home now guys and always remember please guys all spend the weekend zoom out in bitcoin zoom in and live <laughs> she wants to say it you can do it no no it's fine you oh. did it already <laughs> <laughs> try to enjoy every single minute of the day guys because that's exactly what life is about and thanks for watching again do you want to say something yes twice enjoy your weekend enjoy your weekend <laughs> au revoir ciao bye Wow, dude!